Welcome back heroes to some more Pokemon A Star in the Desert. Last episode we did a few more bounties. Uh, we then got a request from Ndidi to go to the forest to try and find Team Cyndaseer. Because they were on a quest, we saw the Arcan and Cyndaseer leave. They went on a quest and they never returned. We went there, found them, they were with the C Dot as well. But Serileg and Armourage were just fighting everyone. They are like very powerful Pokemon. Uh, Simisid was distracting Armourage so Arcanine could get away with C-Dot. We managed to just escape because Ledian came and just uh, held Serileg for a little bit. It was insane and I honestly can't wait to get to a point where hopefully we can fight them. Should be easy for us obviously being a uh, Poplio and a Sobble against a Serileg and Armourage being, being fire type but we, uh, we'll see when we get to it. So let's end the day and we can start some new missions hopefully. Maybe get a new um they had the dojo, fight another team, be pretty cool. Got some battle boxes to open as well. One of the give it our best shot today, absolutely, let's go. So what do we have going for us today? Nothing happening as soon as we leave. Last time, um, Electrike and Grimer tried stealing some um, bounties, or bounty rewards. So, uh, we want to head, uh, actually do we have a side quest now? Yeah, we have to go to the Vespi Crafters. Because C-Dot's now returned, and we might be able to get someone else to return. So, uh, let's C-Dot. It's good to be back. I'm sure my friend here has a lot to say to you. Uh, hey! Uh, you found him! Thank you so much. It was one crazy adventure, I tell you. I'm forever in Brave Vesperia's debt. Hey, what if you taught them some new recipes as thanks? Ah, oh, that's a great idea. I know the secrets of some pretty uh, potent seeds. Oh, okay, cool. The sharp seed recipe unlocked. Iron seed. Amplify seed. Oh wow, fortify seed. Quick seed, get all the seeds. Those seeds are some serious business. You can use them and hold them to make them work. Alright, uh, let's see, can we craft some? Uh... Right, I'm gonna, even if we don't even wear them, I'm gonna just, oh actually I don't want to probably do three at a time, do I? Hang on, three, six. Yeah, no, nah, that's fine. That's a good Oh no, I just used too many there. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> um, yeah, we can. You don't have to hold them. You can use them in battle. So I'm just gonna get a few things, and now let's uh, go back to the Bounders Association, and we can go ahead and get a new mission, maybe. Oh. Hey, oh, you two. Sit with me for a bit. Okay. What's up? Is something the matter? Yes. Ark of Team Cyndaseer has officially been reported missing. Oh no. No way. Don't tell me. It seems that he's gone against my advice and left immediately to search for his partner. I don't need to explain why this is a very erroneous decision, especially when he knows what exactly he's up against. That's bad. He doesn't have a badge right now. Correct. There are many worst case scenarios that may occur. Should you decide to pursue outlaws without our Hunter's Badge technology, since they are a valued and long-time member of this organization, their well-being is very important to us. You two have proven to be quite reliable, and so, I request for you to search them out once again. The first place to search is like to be Secluded Woodlands, which you just came back from. No problem. We've uh, really got to knock some sense into those guys. Let's get ready to go, Voltsy. Alright, sounds good. Any quest we can just pick up on the way? Uh, okay. Right, just gonna double check. We got like no side quests left to do. Yeah, no side quests. All right, got a lot of quests done. So uh, let's go to the secluded woodlands, which mm, wasn't too difficult. And now that we've uh, gained a few levels, like when we went through it, going back through the start should be should be fairly easy. Ooh, what's going on here? Don't really know what I signed up for exactly. These guys seem a little eccentric, honestly. That's right, it's us. <laughs> The DMCA! Actually doing something productive for once. We even have another new member. He's also not a cactus, but whatevs. Hi, nice to meet you. I'm a bit of a thorny situation right now, so I'm here. You'll be fine. Cactus to protect us. Pressure much? Also is also pretty flexible in a fight too, you know? <laughs> really not inspiring confidence, are you boss? <laughs> oh. Let's dance to success at this job. Alright, yeah, you do that. Wait, let me talk to you real quick. Hmm? Oh, hey. I kind of ended up here after going down a river in the mountains. 
might be a bit of a trek back, to be honest. Maybe I'll hang around for a while. I mean, yeah, it's a nice place to hang around. Any new items we can pick before we go? Right. Uh... Oh, actually, we've got two bountiful boxes. Before we go, let's go and open these. Just in case we get something really good that we could use on the mission. You never know. I'm going to snuggle. There's so many cool places around here that my friend has been telling me about. Like the secluded woodlands or the Arriva Highlands. Even beyond those. We haven't been to the Highlands, have we? Uh, let's get these boxes open. We've been to the what, Wuthering ri Rivers, the um, Dusty Ravine. Oh, there was the other place. Well, the first location we went to with the Croc Rock and then obviously the um, secluded woodlands which we're going to go to now. It's got iron spikes, stun seed, and petrify orb. The good thing about this game, it seems like there's no bag limit. That's the one thing I do not like about Mystery Dungeon, the bag limit, man. Sometimes just having to like put stuff in the Kangas Kangaskhan storage just to stay there and you might need it, you might not, who knows. But uh, yeah, secluded woodlands. Really hope we get to find this like Sarah Legend armor arch, it's so fun to fight. Oh, what in the world? There's so much smoke. Oh, and they're going. And Pokemon are running away. This feels awful. We need to investigate. Maybe they've set fire to so like some of the forest, I'm guessing. But let Leo and Anomal. That's going to be super easy. Level 25, yeah. We're going to have a very easy time going around here. I think we're going to kill everything we find because we know there's a rest point up ahead. So I can... Maybe grow a level or two. Oh, magma. Hey, oh. Huh. I thought we told everyone to get out. Get out? Why are Pokemon leaving in the first place? Oh, you don't know? This is all part of our Lord's Conquest. Oh, okay. Let's be burning the forest down. Got to put a stop to that. Luckily, we are some water types. Well, actually, did a bit of damage, to be fair. But we also do a lot more damage, so... <laughs> oh, yeah, she lived? Oh, we got a tiny reviver seed, okay. Right, so bubble beam and... Snipe shot again. It's fine. So we'll finish you off. Sweet. Oh, look at that XP, man. We've got soak. Uh, I don't think we want soak. Voltsy, did you notice what kind of Pokemon we've been fighting so far? I'm starting to think the smoke is intentional in some way. With his conquest this is, it needs to be taught a lesson. Absolutely. But a bunch of fire type Pokemon for us to fight? Ah, oh, couldn't ask for a better opponent, honestly. <laughs> Alright, bubble beam and snipe shot. Oh, just living. Nice. Keep growing the levels. The more levels we gain, the better. Make sure we are ready for that uh, Sarah Legend Armor Arch because they just look like they want to fight, so they're probably going to be pretty strong. Right, I'm going to uh, quickly heal up. So we got a little bit of damage there. We've got a few berries left, that's fine. We just want the citrus berries as well to use if we need to. Uh, no, we go this way, don't we? Behind this tree. Anyone else want to beat in? Oh, Houndoom. So it seems we have a trespass on our mitts. Trespasses? The only one's trespassing is Yule. Ah, seems this one's heart is a burning flame. Interesting. Show me the rage dwelling within you, child. I'll show you the, uh, the bubbles. Ooh, the bubbles, man. Oh, you're gonna swagger me, okay. If we get through the confusion, we should be fine. No. We have like one shot here, but... Almost, almost. And swagger again, okay. Nice. Oh, you got a tiny reviver seed, like the magma. Okay. It's fine, because this will finish you off. <laughs> oh, sucks to be you, dude. These Pokemon are awful. This conquest has taken the homes of so many that live here. It makes me sick. So we'll get to the bottom of it, don't you worry. Yeah, I think we can pull it off. It's moments like this that remind me why I became a bounty hunter with you, Voltsy. Let's keep going. 
Let's keep going indeed. Alright, so I think the rest point was just up ahead, right? Yeah. If we can get rested here, that'd be sick, but... Can we? Yeah, we can. Cool. Got a little bit worried because there's like no Pokemon around here. I assume they were evacuated. Like the rest of the uh, Pokemon that live here. Oh, it's getting a little tough to breathe. So stay strong. Yeah. We're almost at the end of this place. Do you think the Blade Twins are the culprits here? Technically, we left them alone here. Oh, I really hope we didn't accidentally cause this. Oh, that looks like... Oh. Levian's here. Huh? What are you two doing here? It's dangerous right now. Yeah, that's exactly why we're here. Do you know what's going on? No, I've been focused on, on evacuating everyone. I'm about to go ahead and find out. Hey, hey Lydian, wait! Oh, jeez, this guy's a little hard to read, huh? Let's keep following the trail. I can just... Hold on, man. We can become a team together. I'm not worried about you, dude. You're a bug type. There's a fires around here. You're not going to have a good time. Oh, there's a Rapidash up there. But before we go up there, let's just check around here. Nothing. Make sure we didn't miss anything. Go on, Ledian, you got this. I mean, you don't got this, but... Go on, Ledian. Persistent little fly. Don't you know how beautiful and powerful my flings are? Has it, has it not touched your heart yet? Hey, leave him alone. Oh, in another spectator. How wonderful it is to spread these beautiful flames ablaze with an audience such as this. Oh, here we go. Right. Uh, so bubble beam and snipe shot. Oh, don't flinch me with a stomp. Oh, you flinched me. I have to jinx it, don't I? It's fine. As long as we get one of these attacks off, that should finish you off. I feel like everyone's attacking Sobby recently. What's your problem, man? Oh, tiny reviver seed, that's fine. Because Bubble Beam should finish you off. Nice. <laughs> Oh, let's go! More levels! Are you okay? My home. It's been burned to the ground. I have to sit here and watch it happen all over again. I have to wait and watch everything I ever had be taken away from me. It's fine. We're here to help. Oh, and you're gone again. Oh, there he goes again. We don't really have much of a choice but to see where he ends up at. Let's get ourselves ready, Foltsy. I'm ready, man. Let's do whatever's up ahead. You ready? Yes. Who's the Lord? Oh, a Tertania. Go on, Arcanine. Get him! A poultry effort, my fiery friend. You're gonna have to hit me much harder than that. I don't have time for this. Tell me where the others went. I'm afraid I don't have the slightest clue of what you mean. We have come to refine the lands of this area. Refine the lands? Oh, interested? We could use someone like you. I could not even be in the slightest bit interested in whatever nonsense you're just trying to justify. Hey, it's us! You guys, you followed me here? Huh, new company. Hey wait, if you want to fight, you're facing me and nobody else. Oh, you must be mistaken. I have no interest in fighting anyone. Not anyone of my own kind, at least. Huh? What's, what's that supposed to mean? Oh, Sobby! Huh, Ledian! Uh, why? Mighty spicy breeze we have here today, oh boy. And I can hear the sweet crackle of my flames on your wings. Fragile little things, aren't they? Hm. Oh. No, you're... Now, what is the status of this area's refinement? Slow and steady, my lord. I've been doing a little scouting, as you may have noticed. Ridiculous. I won't join a cult like yours in a thousand years. Oh, that's quite an interesting position. Not even if we had an associate of yours in our ranks. Oh, see me, see? Are you the ones keeping his partner? Is this what this is? You're gonna blackmail me with the one closest to me? <laughs> hey, this isn't funny. Don't know what exactly the kind of group you guys are, but looks like, to me, you're just a bunch of crooks. Hmm, you're mistaken. Oh? We have found the one you call Simia Broken, barely moving along the desert. Seems a battle had gone wrong recently, and it was up, up to us. You, you found them? And thank goodness we did. <laughs> We rescued and nursed them back to perfect health. We of the uh, Burning Refinery are not a group of Pokemon seeking merit or fortune. Our goal, in my life's dream, is to build a beautiful new world for our future generations. From the ashes of these forests and deserts do we create the foundation of a more perfect world. 
It is a cause that many Pokemon have grown to, including your friend, Simia, who had joined uh, of their own free will. I don't believe you for a second. Look at the fear you're putting into the Pokemon that live here. We're just playing the long game, my friend. You know how hard it is living in this world? What if we could build a world without the need for bounty hunters because of all the new and exciting things that come from its ashes? Does that make a little more sense? We have great plans coming soon with the addition of three new recruits today. I'll make this offer quick. Come with me back to our base, and I'll show you a little bit more about what we do. Don't even have to join. At the very least, can you uh, hear your friend's side of the story and think about it a little? How about it? Don't do it, Arcanine. Okay, I'll take a look. Arcanine. Ark, why? I'm sorry, I just want to check up on them. Uh, I'm not going to make any rice decisions just yet. Very well. Peer into this escape orb. Oh, you suck, Arcanine. Uh, what shall we do with the rest of them, my lord? Their allegiances have been made clear. Do what you wish. Much obliged, my lord. Well, I'm sorry I had to come to this, but it looks like the end of the road for you three. But what, what about the switch up? What happened to all that you said before? Everything we said was 100% true. You simply don't understand our position entirely. It ain't personal. It ain't personal, kid. Alright, uh, Turtonator's gonna be a bit difficult to beat, but... Hmm... I think I'm going for Disarm and Voice, see how much that does, and go for an... Go for one Icy Wind to lower your speed a little bit. Make sure we outspeed you every time. Alright, cool, we outspeed you. Yeah, that's not great. Alright, let's try Bubble Beam and... Oh, that is a lot. Uh, we could try a Hyper Voice. I might go for a Water Pulse to try and get the Confusion. Too much. Uh, ooh, man. Right, let's double heal up. Let's go for a snipe shot and a bubble beam. No process from that. That's good. Oh, nice. Oh, okay. So citrus berry. That's annoying. Right, I think what I'm going to do... Dragon Rage sucks. I'm going to heal up again. And I'm going to go for... Hmm. Go for a Stun Seed. Oh, no, uh, I think I'll save a Noxious Seed for later on. Uh... What should we go for? Go for a slumber orb. Go for a gravel rock. Play like it didn't do too much damage. Alright, I think okay, what I'll do. Slumber orb. Snipe shot. Put to sleep for a little bit. Hopefully you stay asleep for a little while and we can take you out with Bubble Beam and Snipe Shot. Stay asleep. Oh, you woke up. Oh, we, oh, we just lived with the Paralysis. Okay. Uh, Got to heal up. And then Snipe Shot. Nice. Okay, this is fine, this is fine. Bubble Beam, Sucker Punch. Yeah! Woo! A little bit tough. Woo! Well fought, kids. I'm going to send you to the Hunters Association. They probably have some questions for you. And you too. Bobsy, we need to report this incident fast. Let's head back right now. Damn, man. So it seems that the situation is much more dire. I've dispatched the necessary Pokemon to clear the flames on secluded woodlands. And I have Lumi resting in Chairman's room. Well, at the very least, we have someone to talk to, don't we? I must say, you've cap your capture rate is staggeringly high for the amount of time you've been with us. Do you happen to know uh, 
that Embor character that showed up back there. Apparently Ark recognized him, but I'm not really sure what his deal is. Unfortunately, yes. I know quite a large deal about him. Oh. Is this the same Embor? The one known as Zhao of the Burning Refinery? Zhao is an extremely dangerous S-rank outlaw. Most of the older uh, bounty hunters know him very well for his strength, tactics, and ruthlessness. He's to blame for the entire areas of the map being wiped out in the name of refinement. He says that he aims for future generations, but it's very selective to only certain types of Pokemon. Horrendous. If that weren't bad enough, he has a relatively high level of charisma that lets him recruit vulnerable Pokemon to his ranks. His refinement philosophy utterly disgusts me. I'm sure there's more you can elaborate on. Isn't that right? I ain't talking if I don't have to. So what do you have to gain at this point? Where do you have you captured here? And there's one more thing that's been bothering me. You mentioned great plans on the way. What does that mean? Hmm, one second. Hey, keep your stinking paws off me. Unbelievable. You'd keep quiet knowing, knowing what will come to pass. You stinking psychic types. Get information that you shouldn't be allowed to see. You love all your little gossip and rumors that you can share to your double timing uh, con man you call a boss. You will have no sense of privacy. The stakes are much higher than it seems, I'm afraid. Yeah, that's right. Our next target for refinement, oh, it's gonna be Sandy. Sandy Square. Yeah, Sandy Square. What? There's no way. Not only were we able to find the other half of that Arcanine, we're able to recruit two valuable new members. The Bla- Oh, the Blaze Twins. I know there are some strong folks in Sandy Square, but having those two run amok is the perfect uh, congregation of civilians uh, will make things much more interesting. It's the edge we've been waiting for. With our combined strength, we'll officially put an end to the world of bounty hunters, and the world of the eternal flame will reign for the Pokemon that are truly fit to rule the heat of the desert. Disregarding how disgusting that entire monologue was to my ears, I must say your ignorance has proven useful. Do you really assume that I would read minds because I was a psychic type Pokemon? But you- I thought, then why? Nope, that's a simple stereotype and nothing more. Your information was very useful, thank you. Ah, oh, indeed, he's so smart. <laughs> it's time to start planning a counterattack. Yeah, we're not sure how much time we have before they start marching down here. I think the sooner we figure out a plan, the better. We? There is no we here. What do you mean? I'm water type. We're good here. What? Why? We've been so helpful so far. We want to help. We can help. Please. You fail to understand the gravity of the situation. This enemy is beyond anything you've ever fought against. You'll not make progress by simply walking in and aiming for the bounty's head. We must match his tactics with equal measure. Sufficient countermeasures must be prepared, and preparations take time. Useful or not, you two are still rookies. We'll call in bounty hunters with the necessary qualification to protect Sandy Square. Oh, hey there everyone. Hold on just one second. I'll jump up there. Ah, there we go. Never really get to see what it's like up here. I'm sure you overheard our recently acquired guest. Oh yeah, that's some big news. Depending on when they decide to attack, it might be better to attack their base of headquarters first. Our resources are pretty spread out uh, thin at the moment. Oh yeah, that's not why I came up here by the way. Then why are you here? That one Ledian that stole my bed for the day? Well, he got up and left. Oh, Lumi's already moving again? Yeah, can never really get, get a read on him. Anyway, he told me before he left that he actually already knows where Zhao is stationed at. Oh, and so he left to go after him, alone? Oh yeah, that guy's really stubborn. He's got some serious beef with that guy, apparently. That's way too dangerous. Okay, I know you said we couldn't go, but now I'm really begging you guys to let us go and get him. We can't sit here and wait while one of our own is at risk. Didi, let them go. Are you sure? I say we let them go, uh, go at it first to get a hold on the area. In the meantime, let's get the attention of as many bounty hunters as possible. And besides, these two continue to impress us. Let their bravery and dedication be a shining beacon of inspiration for us all. Very well, you have my undying support. But thank you so much. We will let you down. Let it be known, your mission is to recover your fellow bounty hunter and get a survey on the area. Be extremely aware of what kind of Pokemon he has under his command. Promise me you'll be well prepared before you leave. You can count on us. Okay, we can now head to the refinery. Okay. Uh, can we... It's a Ledian. It's not the same Ledian, is it? Uh, hmm. I'm just a Ledian. No one's suspicious. That's no, ditto. <laughs> 
All right, uh, can we get any missions? Uh, wait, one, two, three, one, two, three. Is that a new one? Uh, I think I think it is. So the client has requested that someone retrieve their all protect orb. It's dropped in the Wuthering River. Please remember that uh, uh, still may be some dangerous Pokemon around. I feel like I did that. Completed. No, I didn't do that one. Alright, let's uh, do this before we go. Just get a little bit of extra experience, why not? So, the Wuthering River. Let's go back. And we'll go to the dojo to see if anyone's uh, wants to fight in there. Nope. Unless we have to take the mission again. That might be what we have to do. Wait, wrong place. Let me just double check. Just in case, just in case. Oh, uh... I think I might break the game. Uh, okay, yeah, so uh, I might reload. Can I fix it? Let me see if I can leave and maybe fix it if I go to a different place. <laughs> oh man, that's not good. Uh, so we're gonna go to the Wuthering River. To get fixed? It is not fixed. Uh, maybe we get into a battle. Sometimes battles can fix things. Please get fixed, please get fixed. Right, the screen's back to normal. I mean, like, it doesn't seem like it's a big, broken, uh, bug. So... Yeah, I don't want to save it in case, like, it breaks later on. Well, hope we get this, get this fight and everything will be fine. Nice. Go the levels, please. Well, there's a lot of experience there, to be honest. But honestly, I don't mind. The more experience, the better. Nice, and Hyper Voice finish you off. Oh, it's not getting fixed. I'm gonna finish this quest. Oh, maybe when we, the next cutscene that plays when like, the screen gets smaller like that, it might fix itself. All right, so we're looking for a Petrify Orb, aren't we? This. Oh, there it is. That was easy to find. Wow. Is that the all, pro oh, all protect orb, not petrify orb? That's pretty easy. He's right. This is easy. Too easy. Unless this is a uh, <gasps> ambush. Ambush. Hm. Uh, what have we got here? Looks like a couple of uh, suckers. They uh, think they can just come around and steal our shiny orb? Nah. -uh. Your orb? Is this Electros' all protect orb? You guys are just a bunch of petty thieves. We are in this fair and square. So what do these guys know? Let's send them crying. Alright, here we go. I'm gonna go for Hyper Voice and we'll go Sucker Punch. Okay, it's uh... Not a bad first turn, I, I guess. A little Icy Wind, do a bit of damage, a little less speed. Hyper Voice will, oh, I guess come in ooh, after their return. Don't like Double Edge. Nice, nice. That basket looks different, it looks really tiny. Oh, I should have uh, sucker punched that one. It's fine, it's fine. Double Edge, ooh, just living, all right. Harbor voice it, and now we just gotta suck a punch and hopefully win. Nice, good job. Yeah, these guys are tough. This ain't fair. <laughs> so the basket was sent to the Hunters Association. Oh, what a mess. Let's just get the orb and go back to the Hunters Association. Okay, uh, let's go back. 
Come on, fix the game. Oh, I can see myself again. Okay, cool. What well I'm brave, Vesperia. These Basculin have been uh, thieving from around the river for quite some time. They've been hard to catch since they always escape underwater. Alright, nice. Okay, three tiny reviver seeds, nice, and a slumber orb. And a bountiful box. Hey, we're back, I fixed it. <laughs> Whew, alright. That was good. Right, now, oh wow. But you must be the ones, thanks for looking after my bud here. He gets uh, lost a lot, so finding him here isn't much of a surprise. Yeah, I'm going to save it because it's been a while. Now we fix the game up, yeah, to make sure we don't die, or don't uh, break it, bug it out. I'm going to have to redo everything again. But anyway, let's uh, head to the refinery. I'm going to do this. Oh, oh jeez, I thought Sandy Square was hot sometimes. This is on another level. I think if we see any rock formations, we can jump across them though. So as long as we don't stand on them too long, we'll be fine. Now let's move. All right. Uh, hopefully lots of fire poke on the fight. Yep. And we're gonna get a bunch of experience as we go. Like I feel like we might be a little bit... Actually, I shouldn't say OP, that turning up fight was pretty tough. Although was it? Because all I had to do is use a slumber orb and then I was good. I don't know, we'll be fine. Alright, uh, ooh, there's a Rapidash there. Oh, I can't get the uh, money from the other side. I hope if I take you guys all- oh, Drought! Uh, that's gonna make things a little bit more difficult. I'm gonna double attack. Or not, pull my back far enough, but... Fine. This fight's gonna be a little bit difficult. Drought really sucks. I, I might just run away from anything that brings drought. Oh, of course you get a critical hit. Okay, curse is fine. Right, I'm gonna bubble beam Macargo. I'm gonna go snipe shot in case we get a crit on Torkoal. Oh, no crit. Nice, that's you gone. Ooh, oh, the process sucks. We can take you out. We got cherry berries, so it's fine. Right. Uh, probably should have bought some more orange berries, actually. I and mean, we got citrus berries, so it's fine. And we got what four reviver seeds, twelve uh, tiny reviver seeds. Um, good. Wait, where are the uh... cherry berry? There it is. All right, hey Rapid Ash, you want to fight? You again. Very good. You'll pay for embarrassing me in the forest. Ooh, you will see about that. I'm gonna embarrass you again. Bubble beam, snipe shot. Flame charge is absolutely fine. Give me a crit, give me a crit. No crit, but I guess you're gonna have a tiny reviver seat on again to get some HP back, yep. That's fine. Oh, that takedown did a lot of damage. We good though, we good. Moonblast. Uh, yeah, goodbye to Simon Voice. I mean, Moonblast probably not going to be great round here, but... It'll come in handy later on. So it looks like his troops are looking for a rematch. We've beaten them before, we'll beat them again. Oh yeah, easy. But I've also got to say... I, when, I, when I first started playing this game, I had no idea that like the final bit, like here, would be like all fire type stuff. So um, yeah, it's nice that I got popular as my as my starter. <laughs> Imagine having a grass type. Oh, be hard mode. I can jump across this. Uh, what's this? Gravel rock. Oh, I should have probably gone back actually. This is the right way to go. Hey, oh, Houndoom, we're going somewhere. You got more moxie in you than I thought. Come here of all places, but you'll see that you've made a horrible mistake. All right, we'll see. All right, so bubble beam, snipe shot. It's fine. Nice. 
Nice. And then snap shovel and hobble again. Oh, the flinch. Doesn't matter, so it should take you out. Oh, you just lived, okay. Uh, we'll go sucker punch. Yeah, just enough to finish you off. Ooh. Didn't even grow a level from that, sucks. Last orange berry though. When we fight Embor, we're gonna be like using a lot of stuff. Blast seeds, orbs, all the strong stuff. Oh, is that more orange berries? Definitely want to pick that up. All right, if you got drought, I think you might do. We're gonna. Oh no, no drought. Okay, in that case, we will definitely fight you. No drought means we fight. Nice, good job. Yeah, without the drought, we can one-shot you, dude. Ooh, now this is gonna be fun. Five orange berries. Oh, that's fantastic. Oh, little Doramuckers. Yeah, we'll one-shot you. So who was, it was like, it was Magma, then it was Houndoom, then it was uh, Rapidash, right? So this time it was Rapidash, Houndoom, then I'm guessing Magma's gonna be very close by. I'll pick up these spikes. Don't have drought. Sick. Nice. <laughs> uh, oh, Rain Dance. Yes. Oh, that's going to be real clutch. That is going to be so clutch. We're going to have a very good time against uh, Embor, Seraledge, Amarage. Oh, it's going to be so good. Our Rain Dance coming at the perfect time. Right, nice. Let's bring it back up. Well, I've got to be a little bit careful because we've got like no ethers or anything like that. So if we keep going the way we're going, we're going to run out of PP. Hey, oh, there's the magma. So you two have uh, gone far enough, but this time, oh, there's two of us too. That's fine. It's more experience for me. <laughs> All right, uh, bubble beam, rain dance. fine. Nice. Alright, so. Uh, bubble beam. Snipe shot. Oh no, I, I keep bringing down the by accident. Oops. It's fine, it's fine. Didn't want me to do that, but it's all good. Bubble beam. Snipe shot. It's all good, it's all good. Uh, actually, I'm just going to use the time revival seed now. Just just in case, just in case. Oh my god, just in case. Right, so, this should take you out and you'll revive with the reviver seed and then this next one should take you out again. Then we'll use the orange berries we picked up, get healed up, and then we're good to go. Nice. More levels, baby. Uh, a bit the bottom now. Alright, we good? Ready to go? Absolutely. So, you've come. Yeah, now where's Lumi? Hmm? Do you really think a lowly insect like that could even stand to, stand to walk in here? Don't be naive. Hey, I'm serious. No, you're not. In fact, you're very far from prepared. Uh oh. What? Oh man. Oh yeah, now it's a party. Just tell me when to start. You must command your efforts so far, but you clearly had a long way to go. This is the world of strength, I'm afraid, children. Perhaps you'll be a bit luckier in the next life. You can just do that? What an embarrassing display. Well, we have much to do today. Hurry this up now. Why oh, won't you do that? Oh. Interesting. 
I'm rather curious. Since you love to do that so very often, what merit do you find in defending those who have clearly lost? It's what we all wanted to do, to protect those in need, no matter what. No matter how weak our bodies, how frail our wings may be, the world needs those who protect more than anything else right now. That's what we truly believed in. And we'd be, we would willingly sacrifice ourselves if it, if, we, if it meant we could save anyone. So as long as I stand, I won't let you lay a flip finger on these two. Especially not from the likes of you. I won't let you take anything else away from me. Not the people of Sandy Square, nor the bounty hunters that protect it. I see. That is quite the uh, valiant effort. You've gained my respect. Oh. Lumi! Oh. What are the, oh, Lumi's definitely dead then, right? What a disgrace. More weight. He's still there. How in the... Oh. Oh, Lumi's fighting with us. Nice. Okay. Right. Uh, I like this music, man. Using rage powder. Oh, it's going to keep... Oh, this is sad, man. I swear, if Lumi dies at the end of this... Supreme Vanguard. This is honestly... So sad. Like, it's sad enough and the music just makes it even more sadder. I swear, Ledian, you better, you better not die. End of this, you, you better live. I don't know how you're... Oh my god, level 60? Uh... Oh, critical here. Lumi's just like, yeah, nah. I'm the strongest Ledian in existence. Being a magma, it's not bad. <laughs> Just really sad to see, dude. I believe it's gonna be an easy fight, and we'll just keep gaining experience like so. Sarah Ledge, level ooh, 55. Hopefully we do some decent damage, otherwise we're going to be here for a long time. I, I don't want to see, I don't want to keep, just sit here seeing Lumi just, oh my god, it's going to take so long. I want to see Lumi just like die. Uh, let me switch. going to go for a uh, rain dance. It's all good, it's all good. Alright, rain dance. Don't let me put a bit of uh, rain on you. Put the flames out. Oh, we can get a crit with these snipe shots, that'd be nice. Right, snipe shot. I only got three PP left? Oh, that sucks. Too bad. Don't like get a little bit of HP back. You know you're doing like no damage to Lumi. Oh, I hit the Ember instead. We'll hit the Sarah Ledge. It's fine. All right, last one. I think the music's really nice to listen to. So, where's this, uh... Legend in the official games, man? <laughs> Give me this! Never lose a fight again. Alright, now we'll just start spamming bubble beam until we run out. Oh, the rain stopped? That sucks. Ooh, I'm low on PPM bubble beam as well. That's, uh, that's not good. I mean, luckily we got, you know, it looks like infinite amount of turns, so I can just keep attacking. Alright, 
Lost Bubble Beam. I guess I'll go for Hyper Voice to hit both. I'm not sure how much damage this would do, but... I wonder if I can attack Lumi. <laughs> Just join in. Wait, man, I'm kind of missing out here. Oh, I mean, uh... I'm just going to keep going for it. I'm going to be here for a while, I think. So, uh... Yeah, I'll see you guys when we... Eventually kill them. It's gonna take a while because Hyper Voice doesn't do much damage. So I'll see you when I probably take out Armorage first. Okay, so we're taking out Armorage and. Is there still another. Oh, Hydro Pump! Yes! Alright, uh. Oh, we got PP for Bubble Beam now? Uh, okay. I don't realize the PP came back. Oh no! What? I had PP them for a second, but I didn't. Oh, otherwise I would have put Hydro Pump on. And then could have Hydro Pumped Talonflame and Embor, but I think Embor is probably going to die with this uh, Hyper Voice coming up next. Or it might be the next one. All that good damage on the Quake, because Talonflame is level 35. Okay, so this one should hopefully take out you. You can take some recoil damage. I mean, a little teeny bit. <laughs> Almost there, Lydia. Just hold on. Just hold on, man. There you go. Embo's dead. Last one. Almost there, buddy. Almost there. Nice. Many days later. Oh, you better be alive. Hey. Hey, Voltsy. Did you hear? Hey, Lumi's all better now. I don't know how, but... Well done. There's a lot I want to tell him. So, good day, you two. Howdy, Lumi. How you feeling? Honestly, it's still a little painful. Yeah, I'm not surprised. But Nurse Ordino said I'll, I'll get better. They'll let me walk about now, so that's a good sign. It really is good to see him moving around again. So, hey, we've actually been thinking. You know, thinking a lot. How would you like to join Brave Asperia? W wait, me? You want to join the Bounty Hunter team? Yeah, absolutely. Of course. I can't think of anyone better to be our third party member. Well, um, I don't know about that. I really don't want to take up space on your team. You've been getting at it with just the uh, two of you for a while. If you're going to add anyone, it should be someone stronger. There's no one stronger than you, man. Well, yeah, that's what we're picking you. Okay, maybe it's not in the muscles or anything. You have an iron will and will stop at nothing to protect people in need. Your bravery and courage is among the greatest I've ever been able to witness. Uh, those are the kinds of Pokemon we want to work together with. Lumi, in all honesty, you're the strongest Pokemon I've ever met. And if we were to add another person to our team, there's no one else I'd rather pick. Okay, you two, I accept. Consider me a member of Brave Vesperia from now on. Alright, welcome aboard. Let's bring hope to Pokemon all over the world. Hey! And so, Brave Vesperia. Continued far, uh, I guess far and wide to bring peace and hope to as many Pokemon as possible. Thank you for playing a Pokemon a star in the desert. This concludes the first story arc of the game. The, this game was a collaboration effort between Renko, uh, Masi, I'm probably going to butcher this, Mashiro Sakura, Frivolous Aqua, and Karthik. Uh, we hope you enjoyed what the game has to offer so far. Thank you. Honestly, that was so good, and I cannot wait like for more story arcs because obviously we've got to find do the you know work to get us back to a human form and got more quests to take on like S rank bounties, A rank bounties. Plus I want to keep using that lady and that lady was sick. All right, uh, let's just see if there's anything. Oh, oh, does it just end right after? Oh, okay, so you can't continue on after that. So that's the end. All right. I was gonna say, can I like go and do some missions with um, the lady on my team? Because that's gonna be super broken. But anyway, this was like oh, such a great game so far. The, the two EV Expo games I've played so far have been incredible. Honestly, so so good. But uh, I'll catch you guys for the next one. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. Peace.